Hi everyone, it's CJ here, and I've just finished a picture that has turned out pretty nice. Uh, at least I really enjoy it. It's a steampunk theme in which I've used mostly greens, several different shades of greens and some yellow in there. And I'll go ahead and give you a little bit of background as far as what I've used to make this. Uh, first of all, the background that I've painted on is a kid's puzzle. Yeah, it's one of these dollar puzzles that you can get from Dollar Tree. And I just applied a layer of gesso from Lakotex over the top of it. Then I began uh, applying some paint. And this was folk art paint and some greens and yellows. And I did a little bit of spraying with some delusional inks also. And then here we've got a lot of these different stamped images. And those, I believe, were Inca Dinka Do. I don't have it right here in front of me, but that's who I believe it was. I also applied some texture, like in this area here and here. And this was Liquitex texture gel over the top of some punchinella and I really liked the way that turned out. And I covered it with some glimmer mist and that was a uh, tulip brand and some additional fine glitter which was a uh, Studio G. And you can really see it picking up right in here especially. I'll tip this sideways to see if you can catch that. Okay, very sparkly. Okay, now the flowers. This flower is by Ashlyn. This is a Prima that I've put a button into. We've got a couple of these flowers right here that are Petaloo. And a couple of the Paper Company flowers. These two pieces are by Jolie. Oh, and, and back over here again, I've got a stick pin that is a Webster Page stick pin and a key, and that is um, a spare parts by a paper company. Uh, several places on here I've glued on, let's see here, and here, and here. These are actual pieces of a watch, the watch parts. Okay. And then I used my Sizzik to cut out some letters. Now the die I used was Trixie Girl. And I put the name Cassie on here. Hi Cassie! And then I added some ink dots and glossy accented it. And I think it turned out so cute. I really, really like it. Now I realize not everybody enjoys or likes the steampunk theme, but I felt like this just came together so well. So I hope you enjoy it. Leave me a comment, and thanks a bunch. Bye-bye.